Hello, Type 2 here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to divide shapes in Illustrator. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. As you can see, I have opened a Illustrator document and let's create three different shapes. So, we can just do that by going up in our tool panel right here. And as you can see, the ellipse tool is selected. If you right click on this, you'll get all of these shapes you can choose from. And let's just create some different shapes. So let's first create an ellipse tool. We'll create this on our artboard. If you're holding down Shift and Alt while clicking, just like this. And let's create a polygon tool as well and do the same thing. And let's create a star, just like this. We can just align this as we would like. Okay, so let's say we want to divide one of these shapes and we only want the half of the shape. There is actually different methods of doing this and I'll be showing you a simple one. So let's just start with our first shape, this circle right here. If you want to divide this, we first want to create a line from here to here going between the shape. We can create a line just like this by using the pencil. You can find that in the toolbar as well. And the keyboard shortcut for that is P. Just press on this and go over to the shape and just find the middle of the shape. And as you can see, this is the middle because we get this pink line right here which indicates that this is the middle of this circle. If you cannot see this, that is because you haven't turned on Smart Guides and you can find that in View and go down to Smart Guides. And the keyboard shortcut for that is Control U. And as you can see, we have now found the middle. So just press right here and hold down Shift going over the shape and go down to the bottom right here and just press on the artboard just like this, and then press on the selection tool. As you can see, we have now created a line. Because we want to divide the shape, we don't have to give this a color or anything. So we can just go over here, and as you can see, it is set to a blue fill. And we can just turn that off by clicking right here and clicking on this none. So now our line doesn't have a fill or stroke, and that's just fine. Okay, so now if you want to actually divide this shape, we need to select both the line and the shape. So just drag with the selection tool over the two shapes. And we have now selected the line and the circle. From here, you want to select the shape builder tool. And you can find that in the toolbar right here. And the keyboard shortcut for that is shift M. And if you press on this, you can see that if you go over your shape, you can now see a half circle here and a half circle here. And you can do two things here. You can either press on this, just like this. And if you select the selection tool again and select the part of the half circle, we've now created it into a separate shape and divided it from the whole shape. You can also do another thing. If you go back, select the entire shape and choose the shape builder tool again, you can see this plus sign right here. If you hold down Alt, you'll get a minus sign. And if you press on, let's say, this side of the circle, it will move that half circle. And this half circle is now only back. And from here, you can just select the selection tool again and press on the line we created before and remove it. We have now divided a shape. And this is the same process for any shape you would like to divide. Just select the selection tool, find the middle of the shape, create a line from the top to the bottom, and use the shape builder tool and either create the shape by just clicking on one of the sides or removing the other side. So yeah, that is actually how to divide a shape. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. That was all for now. See you in the next one.